Yahweh. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Henry, the proverbial old man that pops through the panties of you young ladies out there. Boys locker room, yes we are, but none of us are running for president in this room, so let's remember that. Don't listen to the real channels right now, because on the real channels, it doesn't matter what they're doing, because they're frauds. They're having a debate right now. They're having a debate, but they're frauds on right now. So don't listen to that garbage. Tonight, this is the real McCoy. This is the real debate, and we have it live and here for you right now. I'm the moderator. If any of these two get out of hand, I'm going to take my Louisville slugger and slug him upside the head. I mean business. I am the old man that pops to that purple underwear, and we do boys' locker room. So, little kiddies, get away from the camera. Or if you want to learn something, old Henry will teach you a thing or two, if you know what I'm talking about. Yes. Now we're going to get into the debate, and I want to uh, get off right now and make this happen. Do we have the other best? Right, right, we're going to start off with... Hillary Rodham Clinton, the Democrat nominee for president. Well, 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 well. Actually, this is this is actually a. Uh, I have to say, we are running for president, and I s expect to win the presidency. You know, I am the most. Uh, you know, I am the most qualified person ever to be president. I'll tell you why. I lived for eight years in the uh, White House uh, as the first lady. I also was a senator from New York for about six years, and then I was Secretary of State. I think that the president put me on ice uh, just so I wouldn't run against him. But now my time has come, and, uh, and, and people have thrown everything at me the last, oh, three, four, 25 years, and, I have, and I'm still standing. And I'm, and in fact, in fact, I will be, uh, uh, you know, uh, a lot of people say, why, do you, I would never vote for a girl for president. Well, uh, my time has come because, uh, have you seen the boy that's running for president? He's, uh, uh, he really is a boy. All right, all right, all right, your two minutes are up, honey, now. We're going to do now the Republican nominee.